This car was built in the mid-1920s by the Prairie Thomas Company of High Point. They still make school buses. You'll see Thomas written on the back of school buses. It was brought here to Charlotte and the mechanical equipment was fitted out by the Southern Public Utilities Company, which was then a branch of what was known as Duke Power. The car ran in Charlotte from 1925 until 1938. It went to Myers Park, it went to Dilworth, it went uh, to Wesley Heights, it went to all the streetcar suburbs in Charlotte. When it was retired from service in March of 1938, Mayor Ben Douglas and other public dignitaries got on the car, they rode it to the square, brought it down to the old car barn which was on South Boulevard. They took the motors out, took all the mechanical equipment out. It went to Charlotte Douglas Airport where it served for about two years as the office of the Air National Guard. It then was hauled up to Caldwell Station which is on the railroad track on Old Statesville Road between Huntersville and Cornelius and it became a snack bar. And that lasted until the early 1950s. Then it was hauled to Huntersville at the end of David Street and it became rental housing. The Landmarks Commission bought it. We hauled it to Center City Charlotte at various locations, beginning at the rear of Discovery Place, restored the car, and it went into operation as an excursion streetcar between South End and Uptown in 1996. And it ran until about 2002. And then it was brought here and it's been here ever since. The only thing that really matters is tomorrow. I always think about the last line in Gone with the Wind when Scarlett O'Hara says, Tomorrow is another day. So the only thing that's really important to me about this streetcar is what can it do for us tomorrow?